One day after ISIS claimed responsibility for a suicide bombing in Syria that killed four Americans and at least a dozen Syrians, President Trump shows no signs of rethinking his decision to withdraw U.S. troops from the area. CBS 4's Mola Lange has the latest from the White House. President Trump is set to discuss U.S. missile defense policy at the Pentagon Thursday, a day after a suicide bombing in Syria. The attack killed four Americans, two of them soldiers and two civilians, and at least a dozen Syrians. ISIS claimed responsibility for the bombing in a restaurant frequented by Americans. We have won against ISIS. We've beaten them, and we've beaten them badly. Just weeks ago, President Trump announced that he was withdrawing all U.S. troops from Syria. Hours after Wednesday's attack, Vice President Mike Pence reiterated the president's position. We are bringing our troops home. The caliphate has crumbled and ISIS has been defeated. The White House issued a statement expressing its deepest sympathies to the... But some are calling on the administration to go further and reconsider its decision to withdraw troops. The last thing we want to do is back out of this fight. What we should do is recommit ourselves to help the Syrian people, the Kurds, the Arabs, and the Christians that want to reject ISIS. There are approximately 2,000 U.S. troops currently in Syria. Mola Lenghi, CBS News, the White House. Three Americans were also wounded in Wednesday's bombing.